Hello dear traders, you're watching Financial News on Insta TV with me, Anna Kasatkina. The US dollar opened a new trading week on a positive note, despite downbeat data on the US labor market. The US dollar index is again approaching 92.80 mark, which is close to Friday's high. The mixed US non-farm payrolls did not change the perception that the Federal Reserve is likely to hike interest rates in June. At the weekend, the Fed officials acknowledged strength of the US economy, which is ready for tighter monetary policy. So the market is betting on at least two rate hikes by the end of the year. Meanwhile, market participants are speculating on prospects of trade relations between the US and China. On Friday, the two largest global economies announced their requirements for each other. Beijing requested the US to abandon intention to launch 25% tariffs on imports. Washington insisted on the protection of the US intellectual property rights. Analysts say that uncertainty could cloud forex trading in the short term. For example, investors could shift focus back towards buying safe haven assets. The dollar yen pair is now trading slightly above 109.20. Today, the Bank of Japan released the minutes of the March policy meeting. The officials confirmed their stance on monetary policy. The key interest rate will be kept at the historical low until inflation accelerates and holds firmly around the target level of 2%. Thus, the US dollar is going to put pressure on its Asian counterpart in the medium term. Tomorrow, Federal Reserve Chairman Jerome Powell will speak on monetary policy influences on global financial conditions in Zurich. Investors hope to find a clear message that several rounds of monetary tightening are on the table of the Federal Reserve, so investors will have a good reason for buying the US currency. And that's all for now. Thank you for watching and see you back soon.